Hi, I'm Ben from Machinery Partner, and today we're going to be talking about this machine, the Barford 750J. It's a compact jaw crusher with some features that make it ideal for moving from site to site or working in built-up areas. But before we get started, if you like big machines like this one, consider subscribing to the Machinery Partner YouTube channel for heavy equipment reviews like this one and more. Getting straight into the specs, this machine has a pair of 28 inch by 20 inch hydraulic jaws that are also reversible. So if you get anything stuck in between the jaws when you're working, you don't have to break down the jaw box to release it. You can simply put it in reverse for a bit, take out whatever is stuck and keep on working. This machine is dual power, meaning you have some options for power. You can either run it completely off its CAT 60 horsepower motor, or if you're working in a built up area where you have some noise restrictions or you just want to reduce uh, the amount of fuel that you use, you can also plug it in and run it completely off the mains electricity. Moving up towards the loading area, we've got a few nice features to keep the flow of material into the jaws consistent and the machine working at maximum efficiency. A lot of people tend to want to load straight onto the jaws, but this actually slows down how much material the machine can crush. If you want to keep the machine working quickly, you need a nice consistent flow. To get that consistent flow, this Barford 750J has a vibrating feeder that pushes the material along at a nice consistent speed. It also has a feed sensor to control that flow if it's getting too quick for this machine. Overall, this provides a nice consistent flow which makes the machine crush really well. This machine is great for crushing concrete, which you can see here in this video, but it's also ideal for processing materials like asphalt, demolition materials and recycling waste. If you are crushing something like construction waste that might have metal or rebar in it, there's an overband magnet above the main exit conveyor, so you aren't going to damage a screener or an impact crusher that might be working after this machine by throwing a chunk of metal at it. The exit conveyor can also move up and down or extend and retract to match the height and distance from a secondary machine. Now what's really attractive about this machine is its size and weight. The 750J weighs less than 20 tons and has a transport width of less than 8 feet. That means it can be easily transported from site to site without a permit. This machine is so compact in fact that it can actually fit inside a standard 40 foot container, which is crazy when you think about the up to 150 tons an hour of crushing power that it has. So again, if you just move your machine around a lot or you're looking to get into sites and build up areas, this machine is perfect. It's also on tracks, so with the help of the umbilical remote that's attached to the machine, you can drive it straight on or off a trailer and be crushing within 15 minutes of getting to a site. As well as the wired remote, there's also the option to purchase an optional wireless remote that can be used to control the jaws. So if you're loading this machine from an excavator, you can use it to control it right from the cabin. There's also a few more optional extras that can be added onto this machine. First up, there's a dust suppression kit. So if you're working with a particularly dusty material, this can help prevent dust clouds forming, which can be bad for your health and also make it harder to see what you're doing. It does this with spray bars at different locations around the machine, like you can see here around the jaw box. Next, there's this little fines belt, which is on a 180 degree swivel. This thing is used to carry fines that are falling down through the vibrating feeder, away from the main conveyor, so you can process the rest of the material quicker and easier. You also get a nice little fine product out the back of your machine, which you can sell. And last but not least, there's also an option to have tines or finger screens in the feeder. These are going to stop some of the smaller material getting into the jaws, so it can process those bigger chunks a bit easier. This means you can be a bit less picky with what you're putting into the machine and clothe it up with a mix of finer and larger material. Overall, the Barford 750J is a compact and contractor friendly crusher. Its low noise and dual power design make it perfect for working on urban demolition sites where you may be required to keep noise levels low. It's also super easy to transport thanks to its size, weight and those tracks. If you're interested in this machine or any other type of heavy equipment, check out machinerypartner.com. We provide a range of heavy equipment for any budget or use case. And we also have material and machine experts on hand to help you decide what is the exact right piece of equipment for your application. That's all for this video, but if you enjoy content like this, make sure to drop a like and subscribe to the Machinery Partner YouTube channel so you see all of our heavy equipment reviews and videos in the future. Thanks for watching.